It's almost sunset here in Monument Valley, Utah, and we've come across the Black family, Navajo people, and they have a hogan for a bed and breakfast to stay in, but they also have here a teepee. Now, unfortunately, all Indians are stereotyped as living in teepees. They did not. I am Iroquois Mohawk, and I lived in a hogan, which is bent saplings tied together and then put in a row and then covered with hides on the top waterproof hides and bark on the side and that was a longhouse this is a teepee and there's a special ceremony to each one of those sticks that support the teepee and the canvas which at the time was buffalo hides in the old days but this could easily and quickly be torn down and moved because they followed the herds of buffalo and game and water by the season and the temperature. So this is very quick to assemble and disassemble. Uh, let me take you inside the teepee. Here's the door to the teepee. And you can see it's a canvas stretched around these sticks. And the poles are tied at the top. And there's a rope on there you can see that is for assembly. But they're just held together by sewing the sticks there. And the door is held open by a stick. And the top flap is held open by one pole that would open and close to regulate the fire inside the teepee. Let me see if I can go inside. 